Hi everyone, it's Jeff here and I'm going to talk about sleeping bags. First of all, I want to show you a warm weather bag that I've used. It's a very small, lightweight, and really, it's basically just a fleece blanket. Rolls up really small, compact. I can roll this out. There we go. Fleece blanket. This one is actually shaped like a sleeping bag. So it has the zipper, opens up, has a zipper on the bottom to where you can open it up to let a little ventilation in as well. So you can open the bottom, let your feet air out a little bit. Um, a lot of times you can just sleep on this right, just a blanket right on top. You don't have to get inside depending on the weather. This is really good for really warm summer nights, like 50 degree nights. So if you're not way up in the high elevations, this is a pretty good option. Small, lightweight, again. Um, you can add to this, this is just a little fleece, or not fleece, it's a, a little down quilt. Pop this out, fluff it up a little bit, that down will loft, and you've got one more layer that adds just that much more warmth to this system. And then you could put this inside or just leave it on the outside. Um, conversely, you could actually just use this as a blanket. Um, quilts are getting really popular as a sleeping, uh, for, for sleeping bags. You don't need a whole bag, just a, just a blanket on you to stay warm. So those are, that's the lightweight summer, lightweight summer for real, real warm nights. My uh, main option that I use, and it packs right here in the bottom of my, um, right here in the bottom of my backpack, is this little guy. This is my main sleeping bag. It's compressed right now, so it can fit down in the bottom of my bag. I'll show you what it looks like when you decompress this a little bit. Basically what you do when you compress it, is you're just smashing it down and tightening this up all the way around. Smashing it, tightening it to compress it down all the way around. So, and then that way you can make it fit in your bag. So let's open this little guy up. This is a lot bigger. Okay, so what I wanted to show you is how this bag is more of a warm or cooler weather bag. It's a a mummy bag it's designed for about 30 degree weather it's got the hood so when you're right in it you can just snug yourself down this one has um, a little pocket right here valuables pocket maybe put your phone in there or your flashlight so you can find it at night um, this mummy bag's been a lot of places with me um, hiked a lot of miles it's getting a little worn out this is a ledge, it's a, I believe it's a Utah company. Um, this is a really inexpensive bag. I picked this up on sale for about 30 bucks. Um, inexpensive enough to where it's almost disposable. If this one gets brewing or something, I can buy another one. This one I've had approximately six years. So it's it's been hanging tough. It's been doing really good. Another part of my sleep system is this. This is my Thermarest. Scout sleeping pad. As a semi-inflatable, this one unrolls, and as you open it up, this one you'll want to unroll as soon as you get into camp, so it can start inflating. Um, you can give it a few puffs. Let it start going or fill it up fuller. Uh, this is a three-quarter pad. It doesn't cover under my legs. It just kind of covers under my port torso. Gives me a little cushion. It is really small. Those just fit right here in the bottom of my uh, backpack um, in the little compartment for the sleeping bag. So anyway, that's uh, just a quick overview of a couple of my bags, a little bit of my sleeping system. Um, there are other pads, like I said, there's closed cell phone pads, the big type that roll up. 
and roll out. Uh, you'll see them on a lot of backpackers. They'll have it connected. It's a big old pad. Uh, those are inexpensive and they're great for first time use. This, uh, this Thermarest Scout, um, picked this one up on sale also. It was about 40 bucks. Um, they're normally about 50. Um, but the price is coming down on this type as well. And you can get no name or off name brands for a little lower in price also. Anyway, that's all I wanted to go over tonight. Uh, you guys, happy camping.